Hi everyone, Jeff here with Premium Pool and Spa. I want to go over our Eco Spa product just from a content uh, perspective. Teach you some things, show you some things, show you why this hot tub and all of its sister tubs, the E1, 2, 3, and 4, kind of denotes how many people that they will hold. Uh, E1 is like a basin with a bench and then a little lower bench, and E2 is a two person with a lounger and an opposing face chair, and E3 is a lounger and two chairs facing it, and then the E4 is four chairs. Uh, the main content and bits and pieces will be the same uh, for all these tubs as far as what they have from the filtration to how they're built uh, and some of the lid and some of the other things with them. Anyway, long story short, starting here with your controller, you have a, a very simple controller, easy to use. You've got jets, lights, colder, warmer, uh, ability to adjust as you need to. Very simple and easy access right in the front of the tub. The tub itself is, and all of them, are made of high density polyethylene, uh, super plastic. You can't hurt it, you can't beat it up. If you scratched it, use a torch and blend it again, it's awesome how durable these things are. It's, it's really good. Uh, fully sealed underneath too, because it's a roto tub. It's, it's an all-in-one piece, so no mice or rodents are gonna get into it. Uh, just well thought out, well designed. This company has kind of taken everything that people don't like about hot tubs, I dealt with it. Um, lid, I never have to replace it. it. Saves you 500 bucks every three or four years. Love it. Uh, it works very simply. Uh, there's a handle at the end there you can normally grab from there until it touches. And then it's a lid kind of slide in place. Perfect. And it has a gasket seal. You lose about 25% less heat than a conventional hot tub lid. Awesome. Uh, it works on them all that way. Easy to put back here as well. And then you have lock so that I don't have any children or unruly neighbors getting into said hot tub. Um, also you've got clamps to let me show you that. Clamp it down to indeed make it come and suck down tight to the tub itself. And it's just a matter of that and there's six of them all the way around. Got a lot of keeps insects and rodents out as well. Well made, durable, well insulated all in all, a really solid product. I'm right here, and there's a lovely little pillow, removable. I can get rid of this when it looks a little bit haggard after a lot of time sitting in with chemicals in the hot tub. Nicely thought out. Um, coming back into said hot tub, there are a variety of jets, of course. It's a hot tub, gotta have jets. Each jet is individually adjustable to add or take away uh, water flow at the jet itself by twisting the jet. Each one of them is adjustable on their own. Up here you have some controllers uh, as well as far as being able to add or take air away. Um, if I want to add air, I just I have that much more punch out of the jets to get deeper full tissue massage. And I also have a diffuser or diverter, lots of people call it different things, but in essence this is designed to put all of my pump power to this side or all of my pump power to this side to again increase uh, the aggressiveness of that massage and then take air away as you want to. So fully adjustable setup for sure. A table, there's a table inside this tub. How to love a table. Two drink holders and a spot for bacon wrapped scallops. How nice, or a bottle of wine and both glasses. When I lift this up underneath, I am gonna find two big barrel filters. And this is the case in, in all of these little eco spas. Super easy to do. It's an untwist in order to rinse it with your garden hose. Sounds good every two weeks. Best way to do it. Every three months, maybe you dip it in the filter cleaner. There's not a lot of expense when it comes to that. Beautiful. It sits just like that again. It's nice and firm. From a seating perspective in this E4, when they've designed it, they did a great job. I kind of like getting up out of the water sometimes. This works as a nice kind of back brace. There is a step in slash cool off seat down in here as well. And each of these seats is a different varying height because you've got lots of different body types that might want to get into these tubs. Longer torsos, longer necks, short legs, who knows? We're all built different. Behind these panels in the front, you'll see these are black on this tub. There's uh, basically access to anything you need to get at your pump and your heater which are all inside, which we'll get to, and we'll take a panel off.
behind these front panels, this is the front because your controller is here. Uh, take this off and you have right away, I notice an abundance of insulation. I want insulation. I want to keep my heat that I'm paying for in. They call this uh, thermal blanket insulation. There's lots of it. It's nice and dense. It does a great job and it's hiding as I pull it out here. Our, uh, basically your pack, which is all of your computer workings within the tub itself. It's a convertible tub, meaning it'll work on 120 or 240. And inside the pack will be instructions to where you put the jumpers to do it as a 120 or to do it as a 240. Simply done, well insulated, accessible, gotta love it. The pump uh, is easy access, again, well insulated. Something that they've done in here again, which just is a nod to the high quality build overall of how it's made, is something as simple as a knife valve so that you can cut off the flow of water if you ever did need to do something with the pump. You don't have to drain your tub entirely because they were smart enough to put a stop valve there. Uh, beautiful thing. The pump itself is a one and a half horsepower pump for the size of tub. That's a great pump, lots of power. Uh, there is actually a four horsepower upgrade available in the Performance Series 2 if you felt you needed more and that has 12 more jets available in the E3 and the E4. Um, great product, well done, well insulated, big pump, good stack. They've done all the right things with all the right parts and they've made things easy and accessible to work on, which we really like. Draining is as simple as taking off this plate, which is fully sealed. Again, we don't want mice or rodents getting into our tub. Two screws. Take it off and you are into... I've now taken the drain plate off with two screws. Super easy. Lo and behold, you'll find a string so that you can pull this tube right out, attach your hose, drain the tub. It's as simple as that. I'm now at the back of the tub in order to plug it into the wall. Again, two screws, simply done, which you'll really have to do this once and once only. Off comes the plate. Here's my string, so I can get at my actual plug, which is a GFI terminated wall plug, so that we can uh, plug it right into the wall. Just like that, and it's a 10 foot cord and you're able to just take it out, plug it right in the wall, ready to go, just like that. So long and short of it is essentially, you know where we are, Premium Pool and Spa in Kelowna by Costco, and we're inverted across from Canadian Tire next to Bannister. Uh, come down and see us, 